As coronavirus spreads to over 30 countries, leaving over 80,000 people infected and over 2,800 people dead, there is now a crowd of biotech companies that are rushing to come up with a vaccine against the coronavirus. Now you have the usual uh, big pharma giants like GlaxoSmithKline and Johnson & Johnson taking a shot at finding treatment. Uh, but today I'm going to talk to you about three companies that you should watch out for uh, whose vaccine candidates present a ray of hope. So let me begin with the first one, Moderna. Now they have an experimental vaccine, mRNA1273, right? This was developed in record time. Uh, just to let you know, it, it was ready in about six weeks. Now compare this to how long it took for them to develop a vaccine for the earlier coronavirus the SARS coronavirus, that took about 20 months. So that's the scale at which uh, the mRNA1273 is being developed. Now the testing is slated to happen in about April and uh, the regulatory approvals and further testing will stretch it out to about a year or even later than that, as was confirmed by the director of the National Institute of Allergy and infectious diseases recently in a press conference with Trump also present. Um, now, I'll talk about the second one, which is Novavax. Now, Novavax has not really had a drug on the market per se, but it has really good experience navigating this territory because it had developed a program for the mosquito borne Zika virus in 2016. Um, it had an answer to the Ebola virus as well in 2015 and it also took a shot at the SARS and the MERS, which is the Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome and the Middle East Respiratory Syndrome coronaviruses earlier. Now, Novavax, uh, the work began in Jan, just like Moderna, it was swift turnaround time, but we'll have to see when the testing really takes off, probably in May or June, uh, which seems to be the date right now, and that could stretch on for about 18 months or even later because the company ha also has to contend with uh, funding concerns. Um, also, they have vaccine candidates that are ready for animals, and only after that will it proceed to humans. Now, the third one probably presents the best ray of hope, and that's not me saying it. Uh, the third company, Gilead Sciences, has the backing of the World Health Organization. Uh, their drug, uh, Remdesivir, was even earlier used to treat Ebola virus, right? And it also displayed some success with, again, the SARS and the MERS coronaviruses previously. Now, clinical trials are underway already uh, in China, in fact, uh, because they confirmed it with CNN Business um, that two trials are underway in China, one with uh, patients who are showing severe disease and one with moderate disease. Now this, uh, frankly, is showing the greatest ray of hope against coronavirus. Now these are the three companies that I think you should watch out for now. Let's see what other vaccines are developed and hopefully they can be ready in a year, year and a half.